Uh, well, friends, uh, today we have organized a program here in a village, Kulwari, in Karnal, Haryana, in India. Uh, and with me, uh, we are having Dr. Santiago, Santiago and uh, the Sikh SNAP. Uh, she is the director, program director of Sustainable Agriculture Farming System uh, at CIMIT. So, let me talk to her. Uh, what message she would like to give to the farming community here in Haryana, Punjab, Western UP, and for the country as a whole, you see. Uh, Ma'am, you are very welcome here, okay? So, you have taken over the charge of the director. Uh, first of all, congratulations. You have taken the charge at CIMIT in Mexico in January, and it's the March 29th. Today, you are here in India, in Karnal, in Haryana. So, I, uh, I, I extend a very warm welcome to you. Uh, what message would you like to uh, give to the uh, farmers over here, those who are into the intensive agriculture, as you know? Thank you very much. This is a great honor to be here. In fact, this is one of my first stops in duty travel because I remember from a decade ago being inspired by the farmers of Haryana and by not just producing some of the world's largest wheat rice, now even maize, crops, but sustainably. Uh, you have just spoken to the audience uh, here that they should go in for the carbon farming. Uh, is that uh, the one objective that you have recently added in the CIMIT program or it was earlier being run over there? This is coming out of the deep roots of collaboration of CIMIT with uh, private, public, partnerships with the government of India, with the uh, ICIR, the, agri yes, the agricultural research uh, initiatives here. So it is coming up naturally as a pioneering way to pay farmers for improving soil carbon, which helps the world. But I am highlighting it. It's something I actually discussed with ML Jat within my first week of taking my new position, that this needs to be an example that we highlight to the world. So a lot is resting on the shoulders of these farmers. Uh, well, friends, uh, she has clearly said that uh, urban farming is the need of the art and the farmers of this area should go in for. Uh, Ma'am, you had been to the uh, Central Soil Salinity Research Institute where we have the research platform where the different uh, combinations of the uh, crops are being grown on, along with the uh, sustainable farming. So, uh, how would you rate the platform of the CSSRI? In fact, this also is something I remember from my visit a decade ago. It has inspired me to try to help people in Africa also build platforms. This very one has improved the world by providing information greenhouse gases, how do we make farming more carbon sustainable? So it's really pioneered the way. It is a platform that is a jewel in Indian agriculture research institutes and in fact in the world. Uh, well, friend, she has uh, clearly said that the work being carried out there at the local CSSRI research platform of CIMIT and the Serial System Initiative uh, South Asia uh, project is being carried out for the past one decade. Uh, she had been there earlier and the results she has replicated in Africa uh, from my own and on behalf of the farming community of uh, Haryana particularly. I thank uh, Dr. Sieg Snap, uh, who is the Sustainable Agri-Food System Program Director from CIMIT. Uh, thank you very much indeed for watching this bite. Thank you.